Alright, let's just get like, versus Zaddy of Crimes of Dilbo. I think this is the first time. Actually, I might be lying, but I, this is like the only time I remember a DDD getting into top 8 in this in our attorneys. Uh, I think maybe Zumi did it during the summer. <laughs> Uh, but this is the first, well, I guess this is a pretty small tournament all around, but still, very impressive. And here we go. I don't know how DDD does against Rob. I'd imagine, just from my personal knowledge, it's not the worst thing in the world, which might be weird. But they're both big bodies, so they both can hit each other. Gordo is like a gyro, but I guess Rob can do that. He does have the suck though, and the suck can uh, take the, the gyro and the beam. And right now it's pretty easy. Oh, but there's the bear. The, <laughs> the little suck won't save you from the bear. But right, he like, retaliates right again with the border. Not a lot. But it's like zoning. I think both these, both these characters, but well, more DDDs more attuned to zoning, but I think Rob can also benefit from it. I think a main strategy versus DD is you don't want to rush in versus DDD. Because even though DD is a slow guy, but he does have like a but he's like known as like the trap character. And right now Zaddy's like utilizing those traps very well. I'll uh, be trying to interrupt the uh, suck. But eh? yeah. Gordo is so dangerous. <laughs> Up here? And that kills. You get DI mixed up, I think. But I don't think any D. Any day would say that. Another up air? Another up air? The Gordo. Ah, it hits! Quarter? Nothing. Throw? Gordo? No, oh, the dash attack to try and two frame. Super strong. Gordo? Oh, try suck. No get up attack, interesting. There. Parries it, wow. Oh, tries to go. I don't I don't know if that was a, a misinput. Forward, uh, I don't know why he's going for these forward smash. I, it has to be missed inputs. He tries to suck. Oh, releases it right when he throws the gyro. Up air, nice. Oh no, up air. Just goes off the forward air. Nair, Gordo, gets hit by forward air. Suck, off stage. Anything? That's immediate uh, mash out of the star. Gordo might hit him. Oh, he almost gets the frame. Uh, the ledge trap. I don't think that'll. Kill. Oh yeah. Oh, he delays the get. Get. Yeah, get him. Suck? Oh wow, that was weird. No bear, no down air. I mean. Oh, I tries to get the back air, but I think he was afraid to get stuck. The up tilt, and that's the first game going to Zaddy. Yeah, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think D does bad, which is weird to say. I think. I think DED doesn't really have a hard time against zoning because uh, he can also um, zone out as well. It's only when like you're abusing how slow DDD is, like when you're up close to him. And I think Rob, at least when it comes to Legend of Sky Guy, he has more of a, a, a more projectile-based approach. Wow, immediate neutral beam from Daddy. No! Oh, she used the force up to pick up the gyro, I see. Four there. Nothing. Wow. Oh my god. Grab. Gordo. Oh, the back air. Text it. Four air, me. Great awareness from Zaddy. Nair. Up air. Won't do anything. Up tilt. Up air. Air dodges. Tries to grab. Bunch of spaghetti right now. Oh my god. Gordo? Wow, the Gordo stops right in front of Rob, that's very funny. Yeah, he's really want- Daddy really wants that neutral beam. Uh. Uh, oh, and super armor through the dare. I didn't even know- I forget- <laughs> I always forget DD has that. I guess that kind of like eliminates that option for the Sky Guy where he can't just spike DDD if he's trying to recover. He can still spike him when he's jumping, but like when he does the up B. But it doesn't matter because he got the berry into the. I believe that was up air. Gordo hits him, that's interesting. I don't know what uh, Ledge Sky Guy did right there. Gordo again, the Ledge Trap. And what the forward air doesn't kill, that sucks. <laughs> they need to buff that forward air. Uh, they never. They need to buff that forward tilt. They need to buff everything about DED, honestly. 
order. Nothing. The Legend Sky guy likes to do that a lot, where he, like, he waits. Oh, almost gets the neutral B, wow. Up here? Nice, that'll do it. Down tilt. The parry into up tilt, into wait, into... Nothing. Back to suck. Forward air, nice read on jump. The down air, oh my god! Yo, that was some fuck. <laughs> that was some Captain Falcon play right there. Forward air, no, uh, again? Down air again, oh my god, he's crazy with the- <laughs> Wow. Zaddy has brought this game back, like, immediately, it's just off of that one down there. Forward Up to Forward air again. Man, Zaddy is really good at- Oh, my god! This is, like, the most- <laughs> Like, usually when I fight DD, I, I have a friend back home. Um, who's like, like pretty stereotypical DD, he's still good. That is like completely like a great mix of both aggression and like patience. Where he uses projectiles not to just throw it out, but to like actually utilize them to frame trap. And then it like is able to like go in and, and um, what's the word? Capitalize off his, off of those traps. Very good. Forward tilt. And like he's able to like utilize his like pretty, I'd say bad frame data. But right now it's like he's work making it work against Rob of all people with like really good frame data. Very patient. And just like that, he's like going in. He uses the Gordo, he gets to grab! <laughs> oh, tries to snare. And off from Kalos, uh, I guess that's fine. But, Ka but DDD kills off the side more. And, well, right there he killed off the top, so, like, I guess it doesn't even matter. That guy keeps trying to go for setups, but, like, Zaddy has not fallen for any yet. But, like, Zaddy has, like, that guy has fallen off for all of Zaddy's setups. Nice side B. This is a kill, unfortunately. It's kind of surprising. He tries to down her again, but we, I think... I guess... Oh? No, it's Kalos. Right now, not a lot to say other than that. <laughs> wow, that is like really a... Uh, oh, I guess Fred goes for a fall down reset, but he still gets the backer off of it, even though it failed. Wow, he just opts to go above the... Oh, what's up? What's up? I love DDD. I love DDD. <laughs> this is a good DDD. This is like, like a very like great looking DDD I've ever seen. Mm -hmm. Other DDDs I've seen are kind of like lame. But this is like a fun... <laughs> this is actually a fun one to watch. <laughs> the upper, won't kill. Nice tap. Out of all the DDDs I've seen, Zaddy's not afraid of anything. <laughs> That's what I said. Like, I thought... I think like... Because most DDDs play more patient. Mm -hmm. And just like throw out Gordo, just throw out Gordo. But like Zaddy's like able to actually like go in, and he's like doing very well for like e for being aggress aggressive. You know, DDD has like terrible frame data. I think even then, you have to take advantage of Rob's weaknesses here, and it's I don't want to say he's bad in close quarters. He has down tilt and stuff. No, like that's that. not. Yeah, <laughs> I, I'd say I, that's why I said I don't think DDD actually does bad against Rob. Is because yeah. like once you get it's the same thing where like if you both if you get in bo versus both of these characters, they kind of like fall apart. And right now, like, I think maybe DDD just has better tools for when he, like, uh, tries to brawl against Rob. Rob's also pretty gigantic, so... Yeah, they're both big bodies, <laughs> so it's not like one's at a disadvantage. Ooh, oh, kind of scary. Back here? No. Suck. Last nice. stock. He made really good use of inhale when I had my own game against Up him. Up didn't know how and to And that's 3-0! Right. That was really fun,